boyfriend that is good to you, don't tell your friends. No. Hey. No. <laughs> they take it. Yes. yes. If you have a good husband, just hush. 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 My husband buy me a hat, my boyfriend buy me a shoe. <laughs> <laughs> Come to the office and say, I'm sorry. Please don't tell any person it's me. I say, what's the problem? See, I feel my body is burning. Hey. I just take water and say, drink. Hey. I said, let your body receive peace. Hey. Haven't you seen Jesus sleeping and having a nice cruise? Yes. The disciples are so panicking. Yes. Everywhere rumbling. They wake him up. There is no doubt that we perish, not you. Yes. Amen. And when Jesus woke up, he never looked at them. He just looked and said, Peace be still. Yes. Amen. And he went back and started sleeping. Yes. After this meeting. You see some of you that always you take medication before you sleep. It's expired now. Amen. Amen. It's expired. I hear you. I hear you. So God is restoring peace to somebody. Yes. Don't forget when you trust Him. Number one thing He did for you is what? Number two. Number three. Number four. He will do good to you. He will do good to you. Number five. He will give you peace. Rise on your feet with a clap of Let's make welcome. Yeah. Three persons around you and say peace, 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 Wave your hand and give him praise. Say after me, my father, my maker. My father, my maker. I need peace. I need peace. In my life. In my life. I need peace. I need peace. In my family. In my family. I need peace. I need peace. In my marriage. In my marriage. In Jesus' name. In Jesus' name. With a clap of let's make welcome to the picture. of the prophet. Amen. That's a very deep teaching of the word. Yes, yes. If you are blessed, shall I am blessed. Yes. Lift up your hands and thank God for the word you just heard. Open your mouth and thank God. Thank you for the word you just heard. Thank you for the word you just heard. Thank you for the word you just heard. Thank you, Jesus. Open your mouth and thank you, thank you. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, Lord. Thank you, 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 Lord. Thank you, Lord.
Holy Spirit, I receive it. I receive it. Quickly take your seat. Let's quickly share the word of God quickly. Hallelujah. We thank God for the way. Quickly, I want to share with you tonight. There's something God dropped upon my spirit and I'm going to do it. Because the year is getting to an end. And before the year is over, your miracle will come to you. Amen. Whatever God has packaged for you, it shall come to you. Amen. If your amen is there, it shall happen to you like amen. somebody shall I believe. I believe. This is the prophetic center. So whatever you come in, any prophetic word that is being released on the altar, learn to believe. And as you believe, it shall have a pet upon your life. Amen. Somebody shall amen. Amen. Quickly, tonight I want to share the word of God with you. While I was sitting down, the Lord spoke into my spirit that there are many of us here, there are things that has hindered us, that has covered us from us, some opportunity that has lost from us. And tonight, I'm going to be preaching about the oil of visibility. Somebody said the oil of visibility. The oil of visibility. And ladies and gentlemen, there is something about oil, when the oil, what oil does. And after this message, I'm going to pray, even as I'm talking, I'm going to be praying for people. Then, the oil has effect on people. If you're a Christian and you are lack of oil, Amen. your life is dry. Amen. Amen. There's something about oil that makes somebody become unique. Yeah. If we're, there are many Christians who are not seeing God's blessing, who are not seeing God's favor, who are not seeing God's opportunity. Why? Because they are lacking the oil. Somebody shout amen. amen. One of the things that make one visible, it makes your destiny become visible. It makes your finances become visible. When you start a business, your business becomes visible. Whatever you lay your hand, you, that thing becomes visible. Why? Because there is oil upon your life. Amen. Lift up your hands. Somebody shout Lord. Lord. Tonight. Tonight. I need your oil. I need your oil. And ladies and gentlemen, that's what I'm going to do. After today's service, the oil is going to come upon your life. Amen. I receive. Someone lift up and say the oil of visibility. The oil of visibility. It takes oil that makes somebody become visible. Sometimes, some of you seated here, people want to help you. They are not seeing you. Why? Because you are being hidden. Yes, yes, they yes. hidden your blessing. They hidden your opportunity. Yes. They hidden your favor. But when the oil comes upon your life, it makes you visible. Yes. There are back in the Bible, there are men. Open your Bible scripture to me. Let me quickly open some two scriptures. Then I'll hit on the way. Then we can actually thank you, Holy Ghost. Sorry, yeah. Abba, Abba. Lead, brother. Yo, man, come here. Come. The Lord is time to pray for you. Come quickly. Amen. I'm really quickly open your Bible with me. If in First Samuel chapter four, chapter sixteen, somebody read for me. And somebody open the same First Samuel chapter ten. There's a portion of scripture that I want to read for you. Amen. In like that. Don't mind lift up on him. The Lord is telling me to pray for you. Everybody shut your hand upon you. Amen. Thank you, Jesus. While the gentleman was sitting down, the Lord opened my eyes. Amen. I saw you in a car. And then you were dragged. Come close. Do lift up on him. I saw you driving. And I saw two men with you in the car. The Lord is telling me to pray for you. There is a blessing God has deposited to come to you. But every time the blessing is coming, something actually comes and cover it up. As I'm going to pray for you, whoever invited you here, I see a bigger opportunity God is going to open for you. Amen. Your amen. No, amen is not strong at all. Amen. I hear a certain name by name Johnson, a gentleman by name Johnson. And this Johnson, she is coming from the state. He has a place in Miami. And the Lord ministered to me that this gentleman is going to come encounter with you. And through that encounter, there's going to be a new opportunity the man is going to set. And through that, God is going to set you for good for financial blessing. Amen. Spiritually, there is a certain lady you dated. The Lord is telling you that there was a lady you were dating before. And along the line, that lady, there's something that took place. And because of that, it became, it brought something like, I mean, an obstacle. It brought something like impediment to hinder any blessing that has to come to you. But tonight, or this evening, that thing is taking off today. Amen. While you are praying for this gentleman, anything that has become a stumbling block, that thing is has been taken off also. Amen. Clap your hands and pray for him. Somebody stand by him. The power of God is coming up. I release you. Whatever has been a stumbling block, open up and pray for him. Release you from every form of enchantment. 
that we have come that we will take it off. We got the power to destroy it in the name of Jesus. Thank you, Lord. Lift it for me. Young man, see me quickly after service. I want to talk to you. Where you are in my family? Yes, sit down quickly. Somebody give God a big hand of applause. Somebody has the oil of visibility. Oil of visibility. And lift up and say, Lord. Lord. Makes me visible. Make me visible. Why? Some of you are not seeing God's blessing because you are not visible. People are not blessing you because you are not visible. Spiritually, in the realms of the spirit, you are walking all right, but there is something covering you. Jesus. You've been working in a certain company for a long time. No promotion, no lifting. Nothing is happening. You are walking there, but in the spiritual realm, they've covered you. Somebody say, help me, Lord. Help me, Lord. Some covering, even though you look beautiful, you look very unique, but there is no attraction. There is what makes people be attracted. There is an oil that makes people attracted. When that oil comes upon you, even people you have known them years back, people who don't know them, when they see you, they begin to admire you. Amen. Amen. What, what, what can bring that thing is called oil of visibility. Yeah. Yeah. Somebody yeah. said, Lord, Lord, makes me visible. Make me visible. Young man, come quickly. You come quickly. You come here. Yeah, this man. Come quickly. Fast. Come quickly. When I convert, I'm, I'm doing my operation. I'm very set up now. Lift up your hands. The Lord is telling me to pray for you. There is an oil of visibility coming on you. Lift up your hands. There is somebody you know. He's working in the government. There's a guy in the government. And it's like you know him, you have dealt with him, you have moved with him before, and you have been forgotten. Today, that man is going to remember you. Amen. Amen. This week, because all your visibility is coming upon you. Amen. And your amen is jealousy. Amen. If you are saying a good amen, you shall be remembered too. Amen. Everything. We lose you. Somebody shall be loose. We lose you. Come on, everything that need to make 